Hey. 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 <laughs> this hey. is Andromeda, and this is my boyfriend, Derek. <laughs> and we're going to a lot of exciting places today. Yep. We're going to be, well, we came to this mall here to try to look for him a dashiki, but dashiki. the guy was out. Yeah, who buys 24 at one time? Functions hey. happen, you never know. <laughs> and then also, we also signed up for pictures without knowing. Yeah, I know. That's spontaneous. Spont he spontaneous. was a good seller. It's I called, give him that. It's called spontaneity. And then we get to support black businesses, so it totally works out for everybody. Yeah, everybody. I support black business, even when I don't. All right, well, but, all right go ahead. Let's and go. then we also got some uh, more exciting things going on today, so. We got to go toilet paper shopping. Yeah, you, you'll see about that. Yeah. Okay, we're at our first Taste of Grand Prairie. It's their ninth annual, but this is our first time. And so far, they don't have anybody's vegan food, except I got, what, a chip out of a rice salad? Maybe? Yeah, but may this, not have vegan food. Well, we don't know yet. We haven't done everybody, exactly. but it, it's a lot of non-stuff. But if anything, I can always go to Loving Hut whenever we're done. <laughs> this is a vegan real. No. 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 It's made out of uh, meat. But meat so far, oh, okay. what's that from? Colt? No. No, meat, meatless. No, no, meatless. where's that from? Ruby's Barbecue, that's where it's from. No, it's from Rudy's. Rudy's Barbecue. And then they also have on the border rice salad that was made with chicken broth, unfortunately. That's the only one I can eat so far. Well, not the only one, but mostly. They have Applebee's here, they have Chicken Filet, Costco. They had a cupcake company, we gotta go check that out. I'm some sweets in my life. And there are a whole bunch of other stuff. Yeah, we also went to, um, I think it was Duncanville High School culinary program, what they had. They had street tacos. Yeah, they look tasty. Pretty, they were pretty good, they were flavorful. And what uh, were they, pork? They were pork. Yeah. Even though I do got on a dashiki where I ain't supposed to eat pork at all. But hey. Life as we know it. So uh, this is what he has so far. I'm a, I'm what you call a, a walking contradiction. <laughs> Right. You know what I'm saying? This is a, a rice salad with uh, corn, which she can have, and rice, which she can have, beans. All in chicken broth. A lich. This is all a lich. <laughs> no, they told me. <laughs> oh, well, maybe so. But yeah, that's what I'm having. And it's, it ain't that bad. If it was if it was hot, it would be good. If it was kind of cold. But know. it is a salad. Yeah. But I also like hot salads too. Saying, like you eat a hamburger and he got you your salads with your with your lettuce and that's the salad basically but uh we'll be back and to show you what we got else because it's kind of hard to vlog and have stuff in your hands and i got one more real because i'm, I'm, I'm getting out. double for him so yeah that's making my day so I far ain't all day yeah it's perfect opportunity day, so. perfect opportunity already so we found i found one thing it was a vegan chili from where? Chili's R Us. Why yeah. you look for it? <laughs> I know, right? Well, it's a place called. Uh, oh, Down to Earth DFW. Their chili was really good. Only thing was it went hearty and thick. It had quinoa in it and beans. It tasted good, but you know. Not what I was expecting, but it was the only vegan thing at this fair so far. And also. The Arnold Palmer from Raisin Cane. Yeah, Raisin Cane. I was able to get that, and then also the Chick Fil A. They had their tea out there as well. So I'll let you check out all of what else we got too. And we got sugar cookies. No sugar in. So we got a cookie from a cookie and tacos from. I think it was uh, where they were the Rodriguez Bakery. Rodriguez. Which we can obviously get some vegan from there. It's just they didn't have any vegan options today. And then also we got the baked goods right there. We got it's there. like a strawberry cupcake and I guess a carrot cake cupcake from um, some other some other people. It's right there. But um, it's they a... I asked them if they can do any vegan. They said no. It was from. <laughs> well, Big... they did say no. They just didn't know what it was. So. We got that from Big D. Big D Cupcake. Oh yeah, Big D Cupcake Company. Yeah, about that. But we'll definitely keep looking around, see what else they have, and let y'all know. 
It was, we had ate a lot more than I did. We didn't even get to document everything like we should have, but it was still all right. It was great. And I, you know me, I, I got tempted. I had some of the sweets, like the chocolate chip cookies that weren't all the way worth eating. They were like a little bit sweet. And some icing. I had the carrot cake cupcake, unfortunately. That's about it though. Mm. Wasn't worth it. <laughs> Cause then they had sweet tea from Chick-fil-A that I couldn't even taste cause I had some of the dessert, so. But it was a win for him. He had everything, not everything, but pretty much it didn't mean everything was good you know, yeah. it was worth trying everything to know if it was a good place to go to in the future like some of the mexican restaurants and whatnot yeah they had some spicy chicken something on one of them spots that hit you real real hard after and, the fact and then they had the asian cuisine that had a few vegan options so that's pretty cool so I, I would look forward to going to that place to see what's going on. But it looked like they had a lot of oil involved because they said a lot of stir fries. But maybe if you call ahead, they might be able to fix that up for you. Who knows? But I guess uh, hopefully Loving Hut is open. I can eat me something there since I've been nibbling on stuff that's not vegan. <laughs> mm. This is what I got from the Loving Hut. It's a smoky vegetable fried rice entree. And these are actually the seitan crumbles. I think this might be my first time trying seitan. I'm not sure. It does look like beef. I didn't expect that, but it's pretty cool to try. Cucumbers, sliced of tomatoes, which are my favorite. And fried rice and some little romaine pieces back here. So I'm excited to try this out. I wish I had a knife to cut up my tomatoes. That's okay. Mm. Very smoky. It is very oily, but you know, it is what it is. That's weird. I don't like the texture of that at all. Mm. I can eat this without that whole piece. Maybe I like the if they were the crispy crispy chicken tenders, but I don't really. I'm not into that. They tried though, they really did. And cucumber I know is probably delicious. Probably should have had something in my water. Oh yeah, brush. <laughs> Alright, well I'm gonna enjoy this and I'll see y'all at Sam's Club. But not like that. Uh... Like what? Mattresses. Oh, what are we looking for now? I don't know. Whatever piques my interest. But usually, I actually did have a list in my wallet. Originally, we came from toilet tissue because we don't like shopping for toilet tissue. That's why we're at Sam's Club. Yeah, we try to get it by the bulk. Yeah, because nobody yeah. wants to run to the store when you got down low, close to the last roll trying to get more tissue. Yeah. But some people go to the toilet more than most. And it's mostly the guy behind the camera, but y'all don't see me right now. <laughs> Yeah. So yeah, we're here for toilet tissue and yeah, maybe some apple we juice. We need some apple juice. We need to go that way. We need to go that way. Oh, push the back. I got to push the back, man. Hold. I mean, that's Watch your you toes. Watch your toes. That's you. You don't have to. I, I don't want to push the back. You never do. <laughs> Dude, I ain't got. No dudes push, no dude push baskets without babies. Let in. me know down below if dudes ever push baskets. I believe they do every once in a while. It's just a basket. Only when they you got only when you have only care. when you have kids. And look at the man right here. He has a kid in his basket. That's the only time a man supposed to push a basket. Right. If they would have wanted. If you would have wanted. It's a wobbly basket too. It's all for one to one side. But if you would have wanted, the woman supposed to push the basket at all times. And they see sanitizer for me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But my, I'm sick now. We're both kind of sick. I Maybe why. even because the seasons are changing. Like, it is freezing outside. It's like 70-something degrees. Maybe somebody got a flu shot yesterday. And Without eggs. A uh who? -huh. Without eggs. They have one that if you're allergic to eggs or you don't want eggs, you can get that shot. So. Uh -huh. Blue block. I know one vegan YouTuber was talking about it. So I was like, what? That exists? So they had that option for me and scheduled me earlier than usual. So I'm very excited about that. Yeah. Even though I really didn't want a flu shot, but 
It's either that or wear a mask at my job. And uh, what's wrong with a mask? You look like Michael Jackson in them. Okay, my bad. <laughs> Me stop. What we got? What we got going? Well, up here is my Sam's Club list. No, you can't nobody see that. What? You don't want that one to zoom That's in? I know. What happened to the regular, the white part? Supposed to see. That's like regular stuff we didn't get at the store the other day. Oh, uh, well, let me see where we going. All uh, right. All right, cool. I got you. I see spruits. Oh, sprouts. <laughs> hey, on mine, it look, it look like two O's right here. It kind of does. I see sprouts, B12. But this is from sprouts, so we're going to Sam's Club right here. Oh, okay. Apple juice, coconut oil, veggies, oatmeal. Maybe some um, frozen raspberries if they have. I usually like to put that in my water. We'll see. Oh, I see a whole thing of kale over here. Oh, look at our lips. Oh, so I like it. I'd rather put my own. Alright, we're good. Get away from the vegetables right here. Alright, huh? Let me see. Uh, I got some kale for this recipe I was going to do. It's gone now. It's gone now. So. I wonder if I could use spinach in place for it because I don't see myself eating kale once I'm done with the recipe because it was a pretty big pack and now it's just gone because I didn't have time to make the recipe since I only had one day off every once in a while. So Every oh, other day. I want carrots but not that many carrots. <clears throat> no. Ooh. A lot of bacon carrots. Easy to use. Well, get a pumpkin, make a pumpkin pie for the Ooh, kids. Oh, I love pumpkin. That's Best. a big pumpkin. Jumbo. You see how big these pumpkins are? Jumpkin. Look at it. And they're only $7. Six ninety. That is not bad. But that big of a pumpkin. If you want to jump on your pumpkin season. Yeah. Your pumpkin seasons. Yeah. Ooh, berries. You gotta have a whole other house today. That can't be all they have. No, it ain't all they good. They got some more over there somewhere. Mm, no. Well, maybe. Is the food? Oh, here we go. Oh, this is toilet paper. Oh, never mind. There we go, right there. Hey, hey, hey. Like our toilet tissue. We finna. Oh, look at all the seafood. Okay. Ugh. Ugh. So yeah, so we finna probably about to get the, the three extra roll pack, <laughs> most likely. We gotta see what the pricing is like. We got eighteen forty-six. We got eighteen for forty-five roll, right here. We got uh, 36 for 23. Nope. But Scotch do last forever. <laughs> we got a uh, quilted nim nim. So, what are we going? Which one are you thinking for? Which one are you thinking for? And these are napkins. Yeah, we don't wipe the napkins like that. Eventually, we will be getting some flushables for our babies. Why would you need a flushable wipes for babies? I mean, I, well, I don't mean flushable wipes. I mean, like, flushable baby wipes. I don't know. I don't know. I'm thinking we're going to probably have to go with Members Mark right here. 18 for 45 rolls. I sure hope this is good. But they did say less lint, so that might but, be. But, 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 it do say 1,000 sheets per roll, and that will only got 230-something per roll. So I would say the, the Scotch is probably a better choice. This on the strength of... See, you got a thousand, you got thirty-six, forty, you know, and plus scotch, they la it lasts forever anyway. I think we should go with scotch. What you think? I have no idea. I say scotch. I don't even like buying food. It's a little more. It's like but they're so five thin. You have to use more. Huh? That's why you have to use more. No, no, no. At but, least with this one, you get forty-five large rolls. But I mean, it's two hundred rolls. I mean, you got three, two, four, six, eight. You got like five, one in that one row right there. So, regardless, I think we, I'm gonna go with you because who paying for it? Yes, but we'll find out how good it is for 36 rolls. <laughs> oh, so heavy. Can be a uh, tissue. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> yeah, exactly. We're weak. <laughs> no, we're not. You is, but nah. I was playing. Oh, okay. I was playing. Uh -huh. So you guys, this is what some of the things I got from the haul that I thought was important or wasn't so much important but was bigger significantly of what I got so we had ate at this little stand called the pearl and they have vegan and you know they have all kind of food there and they have so many sections in this guide it's like 
a mini book pamphlet of what they had. Um, they didn't have anything vegan at the time when I went there, but I did check on their menu. And they do have a little section that was vegetarian, and I'm sure anything vegetarian we can make these options vegan. So I would definitely get into trying some of these things if I ever decide to go, if I wanted this kind of cuisine. But they seem like they were pretty cool, Asian. And then I also got a shirt. And it's from the company called Elijah Brook Lael. And it says, serve God and look fabulous. And I basically got this shirt that is Faith on Fleek, which I thought was pretty cool. If I can straighten it out. There we go. Faith on Fleek. So I thought that was pretty nice. So I'll be wearing that soon. And also... I thought this was important out of the bag. It's called Provio Pro Diva of Defense. Pro Diva of Defense. They specialize in pepper sprays, stun guns, education, concealment purses. And I thought that was pretty cool. I might buy into that. And then pens. I love pens. Because they're important to me and what I do with at my job. So I always need a pen. So I thought this was pretty cool to click pen. And then this one is also like it has a phone touch screen. Do hickey. And then it's also a twist pen down here. Which I don't like but it's because because it's not completely convenient. But it's a pen. So I probably use this as a last resort if I'm all out of the other pens or... If someone wants to borrow a pen, I might let them use this and they might end up keeping it. So, doesn't matter to me. I collect pens all day. So, also, this little pouch here. It's a nice little coin pouch because it has a little zipper here, zipper here. And then it also has a little slip here. And I thought that was pretty cool. So, we have two of these. Some of these things we have two of, some only one of. And then this was the only vegan place they had there and they had a quinoa chili that was really good so I thought that would be an awesome place it's mostly I don't know if it's just catering or what but I believe they're in Dallas somewhere they're not completely close to where I live but if I'm able to try them I'll look them up and see if I can go there and show you what they have there notepad from somewhere I think this was one which you know notepads always come in handy I actually won the hand sanitizer from a medical center a hospital and then my boyfriend had actually won this which is like a combination charger it comes in a pouch this was actually like a charger a self charger by itself which I thought was pretty cool to say it was Something you'd won that was practically free. So it's a little charger. And it also came with a wall charger. And of course they never know what kind of piece you have. So it came with all those little pieces. And a retractable charger that you may want to use. Well this is for like a tablet but you know. thought that was pretty awesome. So they have so many little charging pieces to go to that little this or to this. So I thought that was a great prize for him because he always is asking me to charge something. And then this, even though it's not vegan, I would have somebody that might want to come over and eat it or whatever. This, and those, both of these things were from Costco. This one was actually vegan, which was surprising to me. And... I don't know if you can see it, the type is so small and see-through, but I thought that was pretty cool. And then actually, they had a Rudy's there, and their barbecue sauce is vegan, and I'm pretty sure they have baked potatoes, so if I was able to go with my boyfriend there to go eat, I'd be able to eat their barbecue sauce. This is a baked potato or something. So that was mostly the main stuff that we got from the going to Taste of Grand Prairie, which was 
an awesome experience even though I couldn't eat everything and also when we did go to Sam's Club all I got was lemons and some paper products which obviously it's not that important but some we need and so like comment and subscribe and you can see more of my adventures so I'll talk to y'all later bye